What is up, my dudes? It's your boy, Easy Peasy Ham and Cheesy, back with another video. And today, we're gonna be doing some monotype random battles. So, yeah, let's get into it. And I just realized I forgot to do the refreshing thing that I do at like the start to refresh and stuff. Monotype random battles are right there, connecting. And yeah, let's now get into it. Oh, we're facing against me. Alright, so this guy's team's a fighting type. And my team's either good or bad against... Yes, my team is good against him. So that's very good. I'm gonna hit him with a super effective moon blast. He hit me with a super effective stone edge. Put my super effective moon blast, hit him, and lowered his special attack. But he boosted his regular attack. Um, <clears throat> nothing to outspeed. He'll just stone edge me again, and I'll go down. And then I'm gonna, who will I send out? Yeah, I'm gonna send out, uh, Primarina. I'm gonna hit him with a Psychic. He stone edged, and it did a ton, but a Psychic will take him down. But the hail did it. Dude, a good amount of damage. Well, not a good amount, but a decent amount. He's gonna... Who's he going to send out? That is the big question. Fer he sends out a Pheromosa. Which means I'm gonna Psychic him, but he poison jabbed and took me down. And got a speed boost. His speed is... 281, so no one I send out will be fast enough. Yep, I'm gonna send out Shinotic, and I'm gonna hit him with the Spore to put him to sleep, and I went down to a 4 times super effective poise jab. So of course I did. That was a dumb move. I'm gonna send out Tapu Lele. Um, and then I'm gonna sh Psy Shock him, because it's boosted by the terrain, and it'll, it, and it's super, oh wait, no, I don't think it's super effective, but it'll still do a good amount of damage because of the terrain boost. I live the Poison Jab, which is really helpful. Hit, never mind, Psy Shock was super effective, and it took down the Pheromosa. He sent out a Halutra. And so I'm gonna Psy Shock him. Halutra set up a substitute. I Psy Shocked. And broke it. He's stalling me out. So I'm gonna Psy Shock again. He substitutes again. And I'm gonna go down to the. I'm gonna go down to my life orb. I'm gonna send out Florgis. And, firstly, I'm going to protect. He used acrobatics, and I was protected. I'm going to moon blast. He got a crit with an acrobatics, but I hit the moon blast, and he went down. He sent out a Gallade. I'm not going to outspeed. I might, if he doesn't have... Uh, two, if he is basically any less than the full 256 EVs in speed, all out speed. And unfortunately, he did go full into speed and took me down. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna draining kiss because I'll heal up from it, and it'll be super effective. I'm dumb, I was at full health, so it didn't do anything, but now, Draining Kiss will do a lot, and I have leftovers to heal me up even more. I healed up, he then headbutted me, and, but one more Draining Kiss will be enough to take him down, and heal me up a good amount, uh, above 70% with the leftovers. He sends out a Breloom. 
No, I'm just gonna toxic drain kiss and synth synthesis up. He bu oh, the bullet seed will take me down with the multi hits. So, unfortunately, we started out bad. I'm recording this. I'm getting back in on schedule. I'm recording this the same, well, yesterday, same day as I recorded yesterday's video. So, at least I'm getting back in schedule, but. Yeah, I'm gonna, I found another battle that is very good, um, hmm, 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 he's, I send out a Kyurem, my team is Ice type, his team is either Ghost or Dark, do I have a Lumberry, no I have a Leftovers, I don't, anyway I'm gonna use Outrage, did a lot, Spiritomb call minded up, but outrage is physical, so that doesn't matter. And one more outrage will take it out, but never mind, he switched out to Aegis Slash, which will resist outrage. I'm gonna outrage again, resisted it again, and I'm confused due to fatigue. He sword stand stop. And I'm gonna hit him with an earth power. Which will be super effective. Um, I hit I hit the Earth Power and lowered his special defense, but he's in attack mode. He iron headed me and took down Macurum. Hmm. I'm gonna send out Cloyster. I'm gonna start the timer, move the bubble away. Start timer. And I'm just gonna shell smash. Cause he's probably gonna protect. And I'm gonna foil his protection plot. If he will make a move, which makes me think he might not be protecting. He didn't, he shadow snuck. But I shell smashed. And now I'll definitely outspeed, unless he uses Shadow Sneak again. I'm gonna Icicle Spear, because it'll hit multiple times. And he did do the smart thing and protect. But, luckily, I don't get the attack drop from that. Um, I'm gonna Icicle Spear him. He stance changed Shadow Sneak. I Icicle Speared, and the multiple hits will, even though it's not very effective, mul the multiple hits are, will be enough to take down the Aegis Slash. So I forgot to mention before, my te his team is definitely now Ghost type. What's better? My physical attack is better. But Hydro Pump's guaranteed. Well, there's a better chance of Hydro Pump doing more. But he Destiny Bonds, and he lived it. Like an absolute nerd. So I'm just gonna shell smash again. Oh wait, no, he couldn't use Destiny Bond that time. It got me in a very particular predicament, Jimmy. Yeah, I guess let's go down to the Destiny Bond. And, yeah. So, that was a very big brain move on his part. No, actually, I want to save my Revile for later, Later, because it's the only thing super effective. He sends out a Frost Blast. I got one of those. So, I'm going to knock off. He missed a Thunder Wave. I hit the knockoff. And it disabled my knockoff. I'm going to Icicle Crash. But he is just taking advantage of Destiny Bond. The thing is, he can never win like this. Yep. I'm gonna send in my own Frost Last. He sent out a Spirit Tomb. And I'm gonna set up. Well, not like set up, set up, but Thunder Wave. He was Dark Pulse, did a ton of damage. But Dark Pulse got disabled. 
now that I know I'll outspeed, I'm gonna shadow ball, and he won't. Never mind, he psychics and takes me down. So now he knows he can win. I'm gonna switch out to the Weavile, and I'm going to Sword Stance. I think he'll Destiny Bond. He maybe, but he was paralyzed anyway. So I'm gonna knock off and take down the Spirit Tomb. And now we're all tied up again. But it all, who's he gonna send out? Oh, he sent out a hoop pop. Yes, this will be four times super effective, and it took him down. So he can't win with the Destiny Bond Strax. I'll. That'll just cause me to win. I'm gonna hit him with an Icicle Crash, and it's enough. I got a crit and took down the Palace Sand. So yeah, that was. That was a good battle. I got the dub. So, it all comes down to whether this third battle, to wrap it up, will I win it? Will I lose it? I don't know. But we're, about, we're, gonna, we're about to find it out together. If I'll ever find a battle. But I mean... Uh, yeah. Yeah. So, I'm gonna send out a dra dra Dragonite. My team is a Dragon-type. We both have Dragon-type teams. And I'm gonna Outrage. Wait, I just wanna read the fine print on Outrage. Um. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna outrage, just thinking, reading the fine print to see if he could f take advantage of it. But he cannot, so he sends out the Tyrantrum. I'm gonna outrage once more, and I took down his Tyrantrum. Please say I have a Lumberry. No, I have a Choice Band, which just locks me into outrage again. Unless I switch out, which would get rid of the confusion. But he thinks my, but yeah, I'm gonna hold the element of supply of surprise for as long as I can. So unless I have a dragon flying type, another one. Wait, his mold breaker, multi scale. I don't even know what that does. So I'm good. I do not have any other dragon or flying dragon flying types. He outraged me, me before I could do the exact same thing to him. I'm gonna send out Kingdra because he outspeeds me right now, but he will because he one shot me. But he was confused. I hope. What? What do you know? His Pokemon has a Lumberry. And none of mine, and none of mine do. That's unfair. Do I have any little outspeed? Yes, High Dragon will outspeed. So I'll be able to hit him with a Dragon Pulse unless he has, like, a Choice Scarf or something that'll raise his speed. But he doesn't, cause I one shot him with a Dragon Pulse. This has just almost entirely been made up of one. Wait, let me see. Is it almost entirely been made up of one shots or entirely one shot? Yep, one shot, one shot, one shot, one shot, one shot. Entirely made up of one shots. I guess I'll continue. Oh, unfortunately, the pattern did not continue. He dragon pulsed me and he d took me down. So that's unfortunate. But I'm gonna switch out to my Guzzlord. I'm gonna EQ because I do not want my um I don't want my um special attack to go oh wait no my special attack isn't my primary um attacking uh attacking stat and it definitely isn't now. He sent out a Kingdra, he's gonna swift swim. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna Draco. He Draco Meteor to me first. Lowered his special attack. I'm gonna send out a, a Dredagon. And I'm gonna. This is. The fact that he outsped me. This is outrageous. I live the Draco Meteor. But he won't live in outrage. Let's go. I took him down. She, who's his final mon? Doesn't seem like it yet didn't take that long. His final mon was a Salamance. I'm gonna outrage him. He'll outspeed any dragon danced up. If I can take him down now, even with the lowered attack, I still took him down. So yeah, I did. And he didn't get to use his dragon dance. But anyway, thank you all for coming out to another one of my videos. And remember, life's a breezy if you keep it easy peasy, ham and cheesy. Bye.